We showed you some time ago how to make a balloon rocket. You need an inflated balloon. You'll also need a piece of string and a plastic drinking straw through which the string has been threaded. Oh, and you'll need a piece of sticky tape. What you do is to sticky tape the balloon onto the drinking straw. The straw plus string makes a guidance system. So with a bit of luck, we might be able to hit our target. Five, four, three, two, one, zero. And the rocket goes all the way to the target, which was the globe of the world. Now, if you think about the way in which balloon rockets deflate, we might be able to make an improved version of that. Watch this. I want you to pay attention to the way the balloon deflates. Now, of course, air rushing out the back will make the balloon rush forward. It goes fairly slowly to begin with, but at the end it goes down, because as the balloon gets very small, it actually pushes air out with a rush. Maybe we could make a two-stage rocket that has not one, but two balloon motors. In fact, I've already started it over here. Have a look at this. Another drinking straw threaded onto a piece of string, much longer this time, going all the way over to the globe of the world. Two balloons attached to the drinking straw. The blue one, I'll blow up just a little way. That will be the first stage motor to give the rocket a kick off at the beginning. The pink balloon, I'll blow up quite a lot larger. Now, when the journey is halfway over, I imagine that the blue rocket motor will have deflated. It won't be doing anything more, but the pink rocket motor will keep going all the way. So the pink one is the second stage motor. All right, let's see if we can hit the target, which is all the way across the studio. Five, four, three, two, one. And we made it all the way to the Earth from outer space. Well, of course, this is not new because multi-stage rockets have been around for a long time. In fact, all of those rockets that took satellites up and around the Earth were multi-stage rockets in which the first stage gives the rocket a push, then falls away, and a second and perhaps a third stage takes over.